What's up guys, Mark here from VIP Shop Management. Let's see what's new with VIP Shop Management um, this week. Happy 4th of July and let's start. See what's going on. All right, let me move myself. All right, when you search a new customer right now, click on it. You're going to have a menu up top. Your lifetime spend, your lifetime profit, and how many visits. Not just that. You're going to see a very important inf information about in progress. You're going to see if he has any in progress invoices. And it's going to tell you the balance due. And if how like if he owes you any money, how long it's been. Which is really important. So this anytime you select a customer, you're going to see this menu up top before you select the vehicle. Um, if I click on the in progress invoices right here, it should take me there. Let's check it out. See, it's going to select it right there. In this, in this case, obviously, he has two. Let's click on it, and you can view it. Let's see how would that work with fleet accounts. Let's say all fleet. And I'm going to see in progress, there's five of them. And I'm, if I click on it, it's going to take me directly to the fleet account and select the fleet account, which is really cool. Um, let's go back and see what if I'm searching an invoice right here. Let's say 15343. If I search 15343, press enter. It's going to give me an option, take me there. If you click on it, automatically it's going to select it for me. All I have to do is click on it and you're right here. This option should help a lot. Another option that I'm bringing. If you want, um, let's uh, create an estimate real quick. So from now on, keep an eye on this, what's going on here. If you want, if there's an invoice right here, it's going to tell you to. Let's, let's test this real quick. So let's convert this. Authorize it, authorize it. Let's go back, select the track hog again. Select an invoice. See, now I can do that. So it'll take me directly to there. So we didn't have that option before. Um, what else I want to talk about? If you want, let's go back to here. And review. See, now you can have the whole VIN number as a QR code if you need it if you have like smoke test or something or you need it you can print it here to add the customer here you can print it here and scan this and it'll give you the full phone number full full VIN number to do so you gotta go to general settings invoice settings and then right there so you can switch between regular VIN number or QR code complete VIN which is cool um, the last thing I want to talk about, let's create a new other estimate. Or select this invoice. All right. Um, right here, oil capacity. If you don't have the oil capacity and you want to get it, just click on oil capacity right here. It's going to take you to Penn's Oil. Penn's Oil is offering the service and buy some Penn's Oil. But if you right click right there, it's going to type in the vehicle you can click on it it's going to tell you the viscosity and the capacity so use that feature it's pretty cool anyway appreciate you guys until next time thanks for watching